Hi, I'm Lena Gentile for Jacqueline's Power Juicer. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to clean your power juicer after you've used it. We recommend that you clean your juicer as soon as you can after each use. If you wait too long, the fibers from the fruits and vegetables you juiced will dry and harden, making them difficult to remove. Before we get started, everything we're going over today will be in your juicer owner's manual. We also have additional videos on our website at www.powerjuicer.com. To clean, I'm going to disassemble this juicer just like I did in the getting started video. The first thing you'll want to do is turn off the power switch and wait for the motor to stop completely. Then, making sure your hands are completely dry, you want to unplug the power cord from the electrical outlet. Next, we're going to disassemble the machine. First, remove the pusher from the chute. This is what you use to help guide the fruit down the chute to the blade. Next, you'll want to lower the locking bar to the front of the machine. Then you'll remove the lid with pulp guard and the pulp collector. The blade and filter are removed in one piece. Simply grab it from the rim and lift the sides with two hands. Remove it carefully. Now that the blade is out, we can remove the juice receptacle from the base. To clean the base, simply wipe it with a soft, damp cloth or sponge. That's it. Do not submerge the base in water. This damages the motor beyond repair. Do not spray the base with water or any other liquid, or use abrasives that can damage the outside. Everything else, the filter, the chute with pulp guard, the pulp collector, blade, pusher, and receptacle can all be cleaned in the dishwasher. How do you remove stains from the juicer? We suggest you use a damp sponge with white vinegar and warm water to remove the stains. For best results when cleaning the filter and blade, you may want to get the Power Juicer Filter Brush that's available as part of the Power Juicer Accessory Kit on our website. You can use the filter brush to get the tough food particles off the filter and the blade before you put them in the dishwasher. To clean the juice spout, look for the juice spout locking mechanism on the bottom side of the receptacle. Note that it will be in the locked position. To unlock the juice spout, turn the locking mechanism counterclockwise lining up the notch with the juicer spout hinge pivot arm. Lift up the juice spout carefully from the receptacle and remove to clean. To reattach a juice spout after you've cleaned it, simply insert the spout back into its original position until it clicks and turn the locking mechanism clockwise to lock into place. Make sure that the juice spout is in the locked position and tightly secured before use. Once your power juicer is clean, Make sure that the components are dry, then reassemble, and you're ready to make more great tasting, healthy juice. Remember, everything I went over here is contained in your Power Juicer Owner's Manual. For the Power Juicer, I'm Lena Gentile. Thanks for watching.